Hi guys. Um, I just wanted to. Hi guys. I hope the lighting's gonna be okay for this video. I wanted to share my Black Friday haul from Erin Condren. Um, I got quite a bit of stuff. I'm so excited and I can't wait to bring in the new year with it. I did use an EC Daily Duo this year for 2023 and then I actually completed it. I didn't use it every single day, but probably about 97%, which isn't bad. Um, I used to use the HP planners and stuff, but I prefer the A5 size. And so I went with the Agenda, the colorful. And oh my gosh, I was in love with it. And so I decided to go ahead and share uh, what I got for Black Friday. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it first. I should have opened everything first because of the cranking. But first we'll start off with the agenda. I hope you guys can see it in frame. This is the quartz. It's like a blush, very subtle pink. I am I uh, focus planner. Um, I absolutely love it. And I'm gonna be making some changes to it. I don't like gold. I wouldn't mind it being silver or rose gold, but yeah. And like all the other agendas, it's got the three pockets there, the one pocket here, a space here. It's got a pocket here. Let's move that. It's got the pocket that goes all the way through here, place for a notepad, and then a small little pocket and a pen loop. I think this is absolutely beautiful. And this is what it looks like. Sorry, I'm trying to keep it in frame. If I move the camera up any higher, it goes at an angle it like that let's try that hopefully it didn't rotate okay and I'm on my in my sewing room so but isn't she beautiful at first I wasn't sure how I was gonna like it I haven't seen any videos on this except for two out of all the things that I've put in to research for this just to get a better look at it because I don't know why, but the pictures don't show up very clear on my end, on my computer or my phone and stuff like that. So I couldn't really see the detailing, but I actually love this. And I can't wait to get it set up. The next I got this pencil, kind of like paste. And of course it's pink, because I love pink. I have the Plenty, what is it called? The Plenty Pack, Plenty Pack. I have that one in the colorful from last year, but I saw the way that this one was and I was like, oh, I like this. It's got the um, a little mesh thing right here. It's got a mesh thing. It's upside down though, so I don't know. Yeah. And then this side. And this is in the, I think the Flora. It's got this. That. Sorry, I hope the lighting's okay. And then I had it engraved with my name, Tanisha Lynn. And I thought that was cute. So there's that. And then I also got this the ultimate planning pack it's got rose gold she's so pretty because I got it because of the fact that when I use this I think that's so pretty because of the soft pink in here I think and then this just kind of stands out and pops and it's got a pocket right here. And this is what it looks like. I'm gonna leave this, the agenda. And this is the Etta V, in the Etta V collection. It's got a, a pocket right there, pocket right there. Pretty sure you guys have seen, you know, these are all over, these have been around for a while, but it's new to me because last year I just recently got back with Erin Condren and um, only because I didn't know they had I don't know when the agendas actually came out, the A5 agendas, 
So, and I'm not a spiral person. I don't, I'm not a fan of the, the, the not spiral, uh, coil planners. And then there's a lot of paper and stuff in here. So we'll see if I can get through this. I'll try to do the big stuff first. I'm not really prepared for this. This is the, there we go. This is the, the blush mid-century circles, adjustable wood laptop stand. Um, honestly, when I saw it on the website, I just thought it was like a book stand or something. Like you set it up and you put a book here. I wasn't paying attention, but I can use this probably for a book, for my laptop. I can use it for my iPad, just put it on my desk, or if I'm filming or going live and I need another screen or whatever. I don't know. This To me, this has very a lot of versatile usage and it's real pretty. And of course, it's pink. So I'm excited about that. Um, like I said, as soon as I get everything set up, um, if you guys like and if those interested, because I know my channel is kind of all over the place between sewing lifestyle and planning stuff, but it is what it is. Let's see. I got these two washi tapes. This one is Wildflowers and this one is Inspire. I think those are so pretty. Look at that. Look how subtle that is. I couldn't resist but get washi tape. Not like I need any more because I have so many of them, but <laughs> those are just so pretty. And then I got this bag. Oops, I just banged my camera, my phone. And it's smaller than I thought it would be, which is okay. I like it. I just, for some reason, I thought it was gonna be huge. This is what it looks like. This is a canvas tote. What does it say? Color block wisteria black canvas. Erin Condren. It's got the pink and black and the like the tan in the middle. Not a fan of the, the gold hardware, but that's just me. It's got, let's see if I can show this. Sorry. It's got the zipper pouch here. Here's my hand. So it goes all the way to the bottom. Then it's got the snap closure and oh the desk bags inside let's see if I can show this it's got a zipper can you see it right there so I'm curious if my planner oh and it's got the thing for your keys I'm wondering if this planner will fit in there hold on Fit this way. Okay. And I just dropped everything. It's okay. So I'll probably do it more in depth than on this bag, but it fits vertically, as you can see. And then let's see if I can put it in horizontally. So that way, oh yeah. And the bag is new, so obviously it's got some adjusting to do before anything. So yeah, it fits. And then just zip, snap it like that. Sorry, I suck at this. But yeah, so there's that. I don't know how well it'll fit once I put my planner together, but yeah. And then here's the strap that I picked. I'm not a fan of the printed strap because I have uh, the color block of the bag. 
but this is the next best thing I can do. Um, if I had the printed strap, I really love this strap, but I don't think it goes with this, but the other ones just definitely didn't go with this. I would have preferred a solid one strap or a solid bag with the printed. And I seen it and I, the reason why I was looking for this kind of bag was because I saw videos on it that were posted a few years ago. So I guess they don't sell this to the solid colors. Like there was blue, black. It was a real pretty burgundy with the pink with the matching, um, strap to go with it that's the one that i was eyeballing the most but yeah so yeah i got that strap to go with that until i can get another one just move all this stuff out of the way pick up my box as i drop stuff Thing is it's the A5 Desi Rose Premium Folio. And I got this more so for business, like business business. She's pretty. It says Tanisha, and then it says that Tanisha Lynn right there. It's just, I love pink. <laughs> Can't you tell? So pretty. I have an idea for this. I don't know if it's gonna work and I'm praying I don't ruin it when I do it. That was one of the main reasons I got this. So yeah, just that pocket. One, oh no. It's not stitched all the way. There's this, this, this. Oh man. Anyways, there's that. And then you put your planner in here or your notebook and stuff. Oh, that's bummy. I can probably, I'm gonna try to fix that myself. I'm not gonna bother Eric Pondering Company with that little piece. Oh, that sucks. But anyways, I got that. Okay, this is the last of the big items before we get to like the paper stuff. And I got this caddy. I don't know how well I can get it in frame. It's pink and beige. And it's a little planner caddy. Or lavender. I think it said it's lavender. So you open it up. That's what it looks like inside. And it's got this. I'm not going to put that in there. But that goes inside. And you can separate it. It's Velcro here. And then there's one on this side. And then there's one right there. And I got the small one. It's got pockets. Look at me all over the place. Right there, right there. Oh, it's got pockets all around. Okay. But yeah, so I got that. Because sometimes I'm always in my office or I'm in my sewing room, mostly in my office. And I might want to gather some stuff and go to a different part of the house to plan. So I thought this would be good, but because I have so much stuff, maybe I should have, excuse me, maybe I should have gotten the big one. Okay, now on for the little things. I got the magnetic bookmarks. The colors are really pretty. It's like a black, dark gray, light gray, and then the turquoise. Are like It's almost like a Tiffany blue type. I got those. I got the Rose Gold Motivate 
bookmark. So pretty. I got the rose gold asterisk pen holder. And then it, it hooks on right here. What else did I get? I got these clips. I have some of these already, but I wanted to get some more. Can you see it? It's pink, purple, and this has an asterisk today and or to do in today. I don't know if it's showing up. But yeah, they're just little paper clips type stuff. I got these pockets. They're the color blend. And I have some more of these. I don't know what I did with them because it's from last year. So I just went ahead and picked up some more on their Black Friday sale because why not? This one is going to make my boyfriend proud. It's rose gold and it's Star Wars. It says a force to be reckoned with and it has Leia on there and it's just, just a notebook. So I can do some, I want to do some journaling in this, but it's compact so I can have it on the go. And in the back, it's just that and it says Star Wars down here. I grabbed two sheets of these. Uh, multi-colored square sticker packs for my month because I plan on using these mostly for the monthly section so I can color code things in my planner um I grabbed two packs because um it's supposed to have it has like multiple like I think the outside and then there's the pastel and then the brighter colors or something like that's what it looks like but anyways each pack's supposed to have like 900 in it so, I thought these were good. I kind of actually wanted to get some more. I should have, just to make sure I had enough to hold me over for a little bit. I got these so I can label my notes. This says monthly, weekly, daily, information, goals, notes, personal, work, budget, schedule, list, and family. And these are tabs, oh, nothing on the back. These are just tabs. Um, when I redo my setup, I'm gonna go ahead and I will be putting these on. I like how soft the color is. I think it'll go great with my planner, with the new agenda. It has gold on it, but to me, it's real subtle. So I'm not worried about that because I just don't want nothing to clash too bad. And next, I have these sticky notes, the dashboard. Sorry. This is the Etta V uh, Inspire collection uh, sticky notes that I can put inside my agenda. That's what it looks like. So, yeah. Then I got this, which I don't know why, but I got that sticker pack. I got this one for those. I got the um, the Petite Planner Budget book stickers. Got that one. The illustration uh, wellness. They're the illustration sticker pack for the wellness, for my wellness and fitness, you know, and um, self-care section like that. This is, it doesn't say. I'll put it up on the screen, like over here or something like that, on which one this is. And then this is more of a neutral one. So there's that. I picked up the 2024 mini calendars. And those are the colors. Those are the colors. It's hard to see. 
There we go. But yeah, it's for 2024. Use that. I got the Inspire Motivate Plan Designer Sticker Book by Etta V. This is what it looks like. And these are, and the foiling on these are rose gold. So you can see it. Sorry, my lighting's bad. I don't know where other, my other lamp is. This is the Meal Prep Functional Sticker Book. I'll just turn it over this way so you can see. Sorry, I'm not used to filming with my phone. And my voice is kind of going out. I just noticed that. So I apologize. And this one is the, the monthly collection sticker book. And that's what the outside looks like. And this is what the monthly part looks like. Focus. I hope it's focus. Okay, so there's that. And I believe those are all the stickers that I got. Not like I need more stickers. I have so many HP sticker books that I've yet to use, to be honest, over the years. But it is what it is. I got this petite journal. I didn't realize I got it, but it was in my inventory when I purchased. I didn't realize it until afterwards, but it's okay. But this uh, is an 80-lined book. I can, I think I'm going to put this one specifically in my agenda. So yeah, it's just a, let's go ahead and open it. And it's rose gold. It's so pretty. And it's just got the asterisks. Oops, the asterisks up there. Okay, now on to the fun part. So, I'm not going to open this just yet, but this is the horizontal layout in the canvas. Um, it's very minimal. I like this better than the focus one. Actually, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and open it because i got to set up my stuff anyways. So I've been wanting to set everything up and get it ready for 2024. But this is the horizontal. Last year I had the daily dual and the um, classic or compact vertical because I originally got the compact vertical by mistake and I wanted the daily dual. And so I just repurchased it and then I used the uh, compact vertical for um, like memory keeping and stuff. But this is what this one looks like. It's got the vellum with little asterisks up here and up here. It's very subtle. Um, it's the horizontal layout. This is, like I said, the canvas one. Um, I wasn't a fan of the, what's it called? The focus. So, and this has the, the end of July. I mean, excuse me, the end of um, 2023 and then it goes into 2024. So it's got these pages. Oh, that's lined. That's cool. So that's a lined paper. And this is January. I like how neutral it is. It's clean. Um, it's not real busy. I love the um, colored ones. Last year I had the color blend. Daily Duo. But I also don't like... Even though the floral one is very, very pretty. I didn't like that. There's too much. I don't want any more covering up than what I need to if I have to. So this is the monthly, and then this is the, um, it's, it's clean, it's just so, I mean, I'm going to be slapping stickers on it anyways, and, and writing in it, of course, but that's basically what it looks like. And then February, they're just different quotes. Progress over perfection, Let's see April's right here, this one says, find good in every day always have the courage to start you're right where you need to be and so on and so forth i'm not gonna 
keep going into that. So when I set this up, because of all the other things I need to do, I'll be starting off with the first six months when I get to June. Is what's going in there because these are weekly. So I'm going to gently set that right there. So I got the Ultimate Mega Pack Paper Bundle. And it came with a lot of stuff. And I had something, I got something twice. I don't remember which one it is. But this is, now these I'm not going to open because I don't want paper everywhere. But this is the Productive. I think that's what it's called. Project, 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 project. I'll put the name on the screen, but it's just got lines right here, and then it's got the little um, check mark checklist right here. On the back, it's just solid. I think they come, you know, the colors may alternate. I'm not sure. Let me see. Yep. So there's some green in there, some blush pink. So yeah, there's that. I got some lined paper. Just basic line paper. This is the, sh it has a shopping list on one side. This is the, I'll open up this one because I think this has multiple pages in there. So this is this week's meals. I have to keep track because I'm on new medication. I am on a lot of medication and stuff. And so I want to start writing down, being more consistent with writing down my meals and what I'm eating for like, you know, of course, breakfast, lunch, dinner throughout the week. And then it's got a shopping list on this side. And I think that's it. Yeah, so these are just basically, what is it called? Meal, meal plan, like planning your meal, your week of meals. Your food. So there's that. And this one, this is the wellness one. One of these are similar to the meal one, though. I think it's the well. I don't know. We're about to find out. So it's got the tab wellness. Now, the thing is, I wish there wouldn't be any tabs on there or the tabs came separately and we can place them because all these tabs, they're all at the top in the same spot. So I might have to fix that. But this says... Week of wellness, it's got a spot there. It's got a whole list thingy down there. Slide this over. Then this is healthy. This has a habit tracker and it says water intake, goal, and then you check it off, of course. Daily steps, night sleep. <laughs> I won't need the night sleep. I don't sleep at all anyways. And this is self-care, daily movement. So I can put my workouts right here. Um, so I'm gonna be starting that soon. Um, I'm always on my feet at work, but to do other activities, I'm going to start jotting it down. Oh, yeah, see, it has a food log here. So I guess it's breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack, maybe. And then it repeats itself. So I'm guessing with this, maybe I can plan out what I want to eat and then use this on what I actually eat. That sounds like a good idea. I don't know. I'll figure it out. I'll set that right there. This is the budget one. I said I wasn't going to open this, but I'm going to. It's okay. This is the budget one. Um, where did I put this? I don't know. Okay. Sorry. And it says date, description, category, total. And it's just repeating itself. Spending, spending, and they're just different colors. Yeah. Next. Oh, that's just the lined paper. Another... I think I've already done that one. Okay, here I have, I don't know what this is called. But on one side, it's got like 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you can do the seven days of the week. And then here you can write down stuff and then check it off as you do. Oh, checklist. It says it right there. The, and then on the back it has these checklists, I think. Okay, so these aren't on the back. Hold on. I know I'm all over the place. I'm sorry. My meds are kicking in. And I'm burning up. It's getting hot in here. Okay. Uh, okay, so yeah, there's this. And then it's the same on the other side. Are they all pink? No, some of them are blue, green. And then there's... Okay, so then there's these. I had these last year. Both of these. These ones I didn't really use because I didn't know what to use them for, to be honest, because I had other items. But these I used for, um, like, to write down a grocery list. Like, there was, I had produce, um, like fruits, veggies, pantry, spices, meats, you know, stuff like that. And it was just easier. So there's that. Almost done. It's a lot of stuff, I know. I got some dot grid paper. You can see that. This is dot grid paper. And it came with a big old bundle, so I figured why not have a little bit of everything. This is the... Um, it's, oh my gosh, I can't think of it. It is the squared paper dot grid lined dot grid lined crap I don't know and then I got another one of these I ended up getting two of this this is the wellness one which is um where did it go over here so this is the same as this one with the wellness the meal plan daily movement a lot of stuff y'all I can't wait and I did I was gonna film setting up everything but I decided I'm just gonna put it together and then I'll do a flip through so I'm excited about that I'm missing what did I do with it hold on that that gosh I don't know what I did with the folio huh oh it's behind me so I'm curious about something Oh, that fits perfectly. I have plans and ideas, y'all. So, okay, but anyways, ignore me. Sorry. I'm still bummed out that this is torn, though. I'm not even going to try to stitch that together. I'm just going to glue it. Oh, or should I notify them? I don't know. But anyways, this is everything. I also have some stuff from Amazon. I might do a haul on that based uh, to go with all this for my 2024 setup. So that way I am situated and I'm good to go. So anyways, I hope you enjoy this. That's everything and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye y'all.